Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video, I'm gonna be swapping out an EVAP coil and condenser. And I got a few tricks up my sleeve that I'm gonna be showing you how to really level up your change outs to make them look better, cleaner, um, and just perform better. So stick around guys, it's gonna be a good video. We're gonna to get to it, let's do some work. So he's already got the condenser removed, getting the existing pad cleaned up. And uh, should be a nice, easy swap out. All right, so on this job, I'm gonna be sealing off the penetration here where the lines come through with the wall. And not only that, we're gonna be protecting the line set as well. And then to do that, I've got this kit from Airx. It's the Pro System Kit. And it comes with the actual um, penetration cover as well. All right, so what you do, you just slide this on before you brace. Uh, and it's just gonna seal up that penetration for you, keep it airtight. It's got that gasket on the back side. And not only that, it looks really nice too. Um, and then it comes with a roll, I believe it's six feet, like rubberized protectant that wraps around the line set and it has uh, Velcro, so it's easily removable and you just cut it to size. And that's basically gonna give you the UV protection so the insulation won't ever break down. And uh, so it's just gonna look really clean as well. But in the kit, it comes with everything you need. Um, it's got the tap con so you can anchor it to the wall. And um, it's got one of these clamps so that way, whenever you put the, the, the wrap around the pipe, you clamp it around this and it's nice sealed uh, and it looks really good. All right, so as you can see, the line set's gonna be pretty short coming right into the valves here. Uh, so once we get the unit situated the way you want it, we'll bend that to where it's a nice gradual turn right into the unit. And uh, yeah, I think that's gonna look nice and clean, especially after we get the wall penetration fitting on there and then we get it the pipes wrapped it's gonna be protected and it's gonna look really nice So he's got all the copper lined up, ready to go, uh, ready to braze it in. So I'm gonna go ahead, get the AirX cover. Uh, with this one, the, the wire comes with it. So we're gonna make sure that goes inside. So all you got to do is just go ahead and install it. You don't have to actually bolt it down yet if you don't want to, but at least get it on there. That way you can get everything brazed in and then you can insulate your pipes and then I'll install this after the fact. All right, so we went ahead and got the cover installed. Like I said before, it comes with the tap cons. So it's pretty simple. Just drill those holes out, get those screws attached, and this thing is good and sealed. Now, in the kit, it does come with, um, you know, six foot of this um, insulation protection, which they call the uh, E-Flex Guard. Um, like I said before, it does have a Velcro action to it, so it's easy to install and uninstall if you need to but i had a spare piece from a, a different job so i'm going to keep this intact because this line set is so short i'm just going to utilize this but anyhow it's pretty simple you just wrap it over the pipes and wrap it over this um, rubber boot as well so that way you can put the uh the clamp on there and it holds it nice and secure and uh airtight watertight and it's just going to make it look really good So they do sell 90 fittings for these as well. So if you do have a hard 90 in your uh, refrigerant lines, you can install those instead of just trying to make these bend around the 90s. Uh, it just makes it look you know, that much better. But this is a pretty, pretty straight shot. So we don't have to worry about doing any of that. So just get it on there, pull it tight as best as you can. What I do is I just do it that way and then I'll twist it to where that seam is on the bottom. There you go, so that looks nice and clean. It protects the insulation. We don't have to worry about uh, mice or any kind of rodent, the sun deteriorating that insulation over time, which is fantastic. So. Now I'm just gonna put this on and get it secured up. 
Well, there you go, guys. It looks pretty good to me. I really like these kits. You can get them in different sizes and different colors. I think they have the gray and they have a white. Um, and then they have the, the E-Flex guard is in white as well. So depending on your situation, black, white, gray, they got it for you. All right, we're complete. Everything looks good. Really happy with the way this turned out with the Titan outlet and the um, E-Flex guard around that insulation. That's gonna keep everything really, really clean, protected from the sun, um, any kind of animals, ants, or anything like that, bugs as well. Basically, it's just gonna keep it in good shape and it's removable. So if you need to get to it for whatever reason, it's easily accessible. So I really like that. But man, this, this looks really good. I'm very pleased with that product, to be honest with you. I think it just takes your installs to the next level, makes it look really nice. Not only that, it protects your customer's investment, right? The insulation, uh, the penetration through the wall, you don't have to worry about anything, uh, any ants, insects, uh, water, anything like that getting through. So it's kind of a good peace of mind for just uh, a product like that that's easy to install. So if you guys are interested in that, I will leave a link down in the description below, so go check it out. But that's gonna wrap up this video. I hope you, you got something out of it and you enjoyed it. Hit that thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Until next time, see you guys later. Woo!